Good morning, everybody. Cindy Utter with my Artsy Endeavors. Um, first thing I want to say is I'm going to apologize for being kind of um, missing over the last couple weeks. Um, I'm having some major dental issues going on. Um, I was supposed to have uh, some surgery yesterday and get things taken care of, but it didn't work out. So now we're waiting until Monday. But I've really missed doing these, so, oops, that one smudged. Um, I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to attempt to do these today. Uh, what I'd like to do, I want to take a little bit of a different approach on these faces. Um, first thing, I've got some DecoArts uh, sampler paints here that I purchased. And the first thing I'm going to do is just lay down a little bit of color. Um, not a whole lot. But I'm thinking about doing a more of a, um, I don't want to say impressionist, but I'm going to try something with these faces. So let's do it and see what happens. Um, yeah, dental. <laughs> Lots of dental issues. I like that. Alright, so I'm just, there we go. Um, just throwing down some of this paint here, just very little. Um, I just don't want a, a completely white background, so I'm just playing around with the blue and the yellow. And of course, we all know blue and yellow makes green, right? Love the colors like that. They're so pretty. Um, I am going to put a little bit more blue, just a drop on each, maybe. That's close enough to a drop. And I'm going to use this one. Just put a little bit more of that blue in there. Whoops, get back here, you. So I hope everybody's been up to practicing their faces and having fun and, you know, enjoying the art. I've been doing uh, quite a bit of art, but it's more uh, on a couch-bound type of art because I've been in lots of pain. So, um, hey, it is what it is, right? Let me deal with it. All right. So now I've got a couple backgrounds here. Now what I've got is I have a Prima water pen. And this is full of, believe it or not, this is all in Japanese or Chinese. I'm not sure which. I think Japanese. And this is a, a black Sumi, S-U-M-I, ink. It's a liquid ink normally used for calligraphy. Well, I've got it in this watercolor pen. And what I'd like to do with it we are going to, let me bring you in. I want to do, I don't know how to explain it. Let me, let me, let's try it here first. This is just my scrap paper. Basically what I'm looking to do is just kind of like an impressionist. I don't want it um, a full face per se. I just want it to be I want to say artsy, but I I don't know how to explain. I don't know what you call this. More maybe a whimsical. I don't know. We're just going to play. And I'm going to play with this Sumi ink and just see what we end up with. We may do one card. We may do three. Who knows? Um, let's see what happens. i got to wait for that to dry real quick. Actually, we'll help it along. There you go. It's dry. All right, so that's what I'm going to do on these cards. We're on number 35 and 36. So, I, like I said, I don't want this to be a full face, per se. And I don't really want it perfect. Which we know we don't make perfect faces, and nobody has a perfect face, so that's a good thing. And I just want to use... Um, the pen, the ink, to just kind of give a, I don't know, I don't know what I'm talking about, just kind of a, uh, artsy feel, a, uh, what's the word I'm looking for, abstract, not really abstract, strange, there you go, see, and I'm not, I just want to play. That's what I'm doing. I'm just playing. 
And let's just play. And again, I'm using this pen, this ink. Just, oops, that's quite large. Okay, let's see what we can do here. Yeah, I yeah, I haven't been practicing in a while. Can you tell? I can tell. <laughs> I definitely can tell. Again, I don't want this to be, I want more of a suggestion of a face versus a full face. I don't like her lips, I can tell you that. But you know what, that's okay. Because we're just playing. Let's give her a little bit bigger pupil. I'm really not happy with her lips. So let's see what we can do. Ah, uh, we're really gonna mess them up. Ah, ha, ha. I don't like her. Let's try another one. Okay, so 36. All right, let's do this a little bit different. It's very uh, challenging also to work with this type of a pen because you can either do a real tiny line or a real thick line. So trying to figure out how to get the marks that you want without emptying the whole pen is, is quite um, interesting. See, I didn't really want that dark of a line. playing so um, here in upstate New York uh, winter is upon us we have let's see what it is outside right now very cold um, it's supposed to be a high of nine degrees today right now it's actually 10 so it lied um, and it's supposed to be like this for the next few days, so um, guess where I'm going to be? Right here. Right here playing because I hate, 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 hate the cold. I'm liking these. Uh, they're a little bit different. <coughs> Pardon me. And um, I still don't like her mouth, but hey, you know, like I said, it's been a while since I've been doing this. But I kind of like this sketchy style that, um, and I really don't have any, um, I can't go back and change it because I'm actually using this ink. So you really have to think about um, what you're doing. But I like this kind of, you know, your eyes fill in the rest to realize that it's a human face. <laughs> it's supposed to look like a human face anyways. I gotta do something with her lips. Alright, you know what? I want to do this again because I'm enjoying this style. So let's grab a couple more cards. We're going to try this with a guy too. So we're just going to grab a couple more cards here. And if I can get them apart, come on. Let's see what we have left on our ink. Do we have any paint? No paint left. Did I use that one or did I use this one? Doesn't matter, there's no paint. Let's take some red. Paint goobers. Ew. I used to save all those. I used to save like the paints that were in the bottom of my um, paint tray. And I actually did some art with them. I made this old man carrying a, a sack on his back. Someday if I remember, I'll get a picture of it and share it. But it was all made out of the uh, leftover. Let's add a little bit of... Ooh. 
Well, it needs to be shaken out. And just a touch of white. Actually, I'm going to do this to a couple cards, so... I just kind of like this, this type of a background feel. Let me tell you, I have missed, missed, missed playing at my desk. But this kind of weather, just between the weather, the dental, you know, <laughs> it's life. Life is good. Okay. <laughs> I like those little dots. We're going to give them some dots, right? Dots, little dots. Pretty cool, huh? I think so. All right. So just a quick hit with the dryer on these. And let's do this again. Oops, I got my ink pen here. Again, my Sumi ink. And let's see what we can do. I'm thinking a little bit different here. Let's see what what happens. going to try a little bit different we're going to make a square guy <laughs> he he doesn't he look vicious he looks mean Yeah, it's fun. I'm just, I'm playing. This is just pure play. What you're seeing me do right here, right now, is nothing but play. I'm enjoying. Um, I'm having fun with it. <laughs> you know what he looks like? He looks like one of those um, rooks in uh, the little castles in chess. <laughs> That's what he reminds me of. I'm sorry, I have to laugh. <laughs> I love him though. He's kind of cool. I don't know if these people or peeps are gonna. Oh, I gave him some earrings. If these peeps are gonna get their uh, name or not. Yeah, his name is George. Hi, George. Hi, I like him. My phone a ping ponging. I like him. He's kind of cool. George. <laughs> I'm sorry, I have to laugh. <laughs> he looks like a, a, a rook. <laughs> oh gosh, I don't know what the chess piece is. Hi, George. <laughs> He's kind of cool. Oh, I hope you guys have been missing this. This is crazy. <laughs> Uh, I like them though. Hey, they're different. Let's try. Let's see if we can make George a brother. <laughs> oh gosh. Let's see here. Um, it's funny because I always start the same exact way. Uh, I'm sorry. I'm making myself laugh today. That's good. I needed it. <laughs> uh, if I didn't laugh, I'd be crying. I was so upset yesterday. I went down... Like I said, went to the dentist, um, getting a bunch of uh, surgery done to, to get, you know, some new teeth put in. And, you know, first of all, the place that was bringing my teeth was late. Um, and then, 
we get the teeth in, and thank goodness my dentist, he's, he's such a sweet guy. He's like, I'm not going to do anything until we see these teeth and, you know, make sure we have what we need. So, he gets the teeth in, and I, I'm waiting for him, and all of a sudden I hear, oops. <laughs> I'm like, oh, no. So, I, I went and found him, and I'm like, what's up? And, uh... The teeth themselves look wonderful. They look really, really good. Um, but there was an issue with the actual gum portion of the teeth. And that issue was um, it was very thin. And it, it could have broken very easily. And I don't, you know, we discussed it. We talked about, you know, what can we do? Um, can we still pull what's left of the teeth and uh, make it, you know, uh, use those teeth to be able to give me, you know, a full set and, you know, with the money I'm paying for, I don't, I don't want something that's gonna just turn around and break if I, you know, bite into something. That's, that's not what I'm paying for. So after much discussion and um, Hemin and Han, we, we both decided that no, that's not what we want. Um, we want to have, you know, decent teeth. I'm not sure if this is a guy or a girl. I have no idea. I'm just, I'm enjoying this process. Um, so, you know, we're going to make this into a girl, I think. Let's give her some longer hair. Uh, George, you didn't get a brother. You got a sister. Um, so anyways, it, you know, it, it was very disappointing because the, the work that I have to have done is going to be, um, it's extensive. And it's going to be quite painful. And I had, <laughs> had pretty much psyched myself up for that. And then, oh no, now we got to wait till Monday. <laughs> so I get to do it all over again. <laughs> but you know what? That's okay. We're going to... I don't like these lips. I have a problem with lips today. Let's see what's going on. Let's play with lips. I'm just, you know, I'm just playing with... I have a problem, I think it is, with the top lip. And I don't know is it's, um, I need to train my muscles to get into that, that, <laughs> that shape. I'm definitely going to be watching some videos on lips because I'm having issues with lips today. But that's okay. Alright, well, she's got... She has a brother named George. <clears throat> Let me look. All right, I figured out their names. So this is George. This is Ginny. George and Ginny. And let's see. This is going to be Deb. Did I do a Deb yet? I don't think I did. So this one's going to be a Deb. And this one's going to be a Darcy. Oh, they're crazy. <laughs> so much fun, aren't they? I love it. I'm going to play around with some more lips and noses. And I just hope you enjoyed this. I had to get back here and I had to do some videos. And I just I wanted to play. So here we go. We got Ginny, George, Darcy, and Deb. As always, have fun. That's what life's all about. And uh, happy creating. Bye.